Hi there and welcome to my channel. Right, what I'm going to show you today is just something we found around the car boots today. Something quite close to my heart again, seeing I'm an 80s kid. Thundercats. Basically, when you was a kid, if you were, you know, just the normal kid, you were a He-Man fan. If you were like the cool emo type kid, Thundercats was the one to go for. Right, a bit darker than He-Man, I suppose. He-Man was a bit more camp and Thundercats was a little bit more scary. Anyway, these are the um, Thundercats figures. If you're a collector to Thundercat figures, it is really, really hard to find mint condition. Even ones brand new in a packet, they were quite crudely painted. And a lot of the time, I think they were rushed out and they must have been put in boxes. You know, not completely, fully dry. It's really hard to find absolute mint ones. So if you do have mint ones, I'll tell you who is really easy. He's actually an easy one to find mint. And he was usually put, usually put in a mail away. Because what you used to do with this is you used to redeem the tickets and you'd get one of the Mumras. Obviously that's mum, Mummified Mumra. This one here, I don't know in America and everywhere else. But Pumra, she was one of the really, really hard ones to get in the UK. Linkso was hard, Pumra was hard, Bengali was hard. Do you know who was easy? Everyone raves about this, you know, the Americans... You know, in the price guys, they have Jago as, you know, the most valuable one. Jago was actually in the UK pretty easy to get hold of. You know, I've had tons of Jagos. I think it's harder to get a hold of um, this girl than Bengali in the UK anyway. So I suppose every different, you know, you look at price guides, every single country has, you know, different type of how many's were produced. She's actually quite a rare one to get in the UK. This one here, as you can see, the face is really, really nice on her. Unfortunately, like all Thundercat figures, there's always somewhere a defect with them. Battle action will work. Really nicely looked after, but look. Telltale sign of some problem with that. And she's got a paint splodge just there where it's just came off. So apart from that, she's really nice. Very easy to fix. I could just airbrush that and fix it. No problem at all. But what I will do is I will probably just sell these in a job lot. Probably put them on somewhere like eBay, Amazon and just let them go. She was quite common as well to get in the UK. I remember not long ago there was a shop called Pound Stretch. I don't know if the collectors know. And the shelves were full of these. Mint on card, $1.99. Me and my friend brought tons of them. Um, this one's a nice one. What's really nice about him, the condition is absolutely awesome on him. Really, really nice example. He still has his chain. That's Mumra's dog. And then we've got, I think this is Willy Kit. Should have a little surfboard. Again, a nice example here is whoever owned these before I brought them out, she looked after them. We've got, I think he was off at a program called Acceptors or something like that. He isn't a Thundercats, but I've just put him in there. Then we've got these ones, which were the dead common ones. You'd go in Woolworths as a kid, and they'd be full of these ones. For some reason, you'd look for your figures, and it'd be full of this guy and this guy. Everyone would take everyone else. No one would want these two. So, I think every collection you see in the UK <laughs> got one of these two guys. Again, they're in quite good condition, actually. He still has his shoulder strap as well. But these are Thundercats. And to be honest, I really, really miss LJN. It's a little bit like Kenna now. I really miss Kenna and, you know, they went to Hasbro. LJN made some really cool toys. You know, I don't know who the guy was who was in charge, but he used to get some rights for some more darker stuff and some cooler stuff. And I really, really love LJN. Obviously, Mattel, as a kid, being a He-Man fan, were brilliant. But I really miss LJN and I'm sure collectors do as well. But anyway, this is a quick video on the Thundercats. And I just think they're awesome. Really, really nice figures. Just shame my ladder for can't get to play with stuff like this. And he has to put up with really rubbish naff figures like Ben 10 and stuff like that. <laughs> anyway, thanks for looking. Please like, comment, subscribe. But these are Thundercats. Really recommend collecting these. Awesome. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.